All right, so on my Twitter, I put out a tweet asking anybody if they wanted to play Pro-Am. You should be following me, by the way. The first people to hit me up were the people I ran with, and this is how it went. If you're interested in checking out some 2K accounts or even Fortnite accounts, make sure you hit up legit accounts on Twitter. Their link will be in the description. Hey, what's good YouTube? It's Young Precise here, back at it with another Pro-Am video. He actually picked up a pretty decent squad, I'm not gonna lie, had a sharpen at the center. Palm oil, please, at uh, Shot Sharp, he usually plays lock, but he is a 2K League vet, alright? He was season one, played on the Celtics, and uh, he was on my squad for when uh, we played pickups. Our team name was actually uh, ZD Tryouts, Zero Doubt Tryouts, but they weren't trying out, we were just doing a pickup team. And this first game, super close i was absolutely carrying the offense it was super easy i just don't understand how we let them score so much it should have been a blowout but it was a close game you see right here we're down three and I get a play down there to Z. He was just a center we picked up. We also had a slasher on the team, kind of like a Kel build, but not really a 6'10 slasher. You see, I throw a lob to him right there. His name is Rich, and uh, he's always asking to play. So I thought when I was playing pickups, uh, I'd be able to play with him. And see, right here, I was doing five out, especially with my takeover. I was absolutely killing everybody this day. No one could guard me with my takeover. <laughs> Make my free throw. I was so locked in. <laughs> like, I was scoring every possession I knew I had to because it was such a close game. So, you see, we're down one, three minutes left. We're trying our best. Dev comes up clutch with a steal. He's actually a pretty good lockdown. Hits me for the lock of the play. Let's go. And also, I wasn't recording my mic. So, uh, you hear my teammates, and that's it. Uh, I should have been recording my mic. I wish I was, but so that's why I'm kind of doing this post commentary. We're up two points. Got to close the game out. I'm doing ISO with my takeover. Sheesh, I thought, see, usually when I do that move, they would jump, but they didn't. It gives us a secure lead right there. A uh, four. They have a wide open three. They blow it. They just started choking, you know. But me, I can never fold. It's not, like I'm like Malik, bro. Look at me. Just green. Oh. 41 points basically secured up the game. I mean, they weren't doing nothing on offense in the end. Completely ended it. Palm brings it up, passes it over to Z, passes it over to Rich in the corner. And Dev just, you know, ends it out. <laughs> oh, that's me, that's me, that's me. I thought he was going to cut in for the law, but he ended up going to the corner. It's whatever. We definitely secured the lead at the end Man, by 14, even though it's a close game all throughout. Drop 43 real quick. You know I had to come to the court and to score every time. Now you see we're 3-1 and one playing against a team that's 18-2. and two. We weren't actually 3-1. and one. We lagged out of the game before it even started. We didn't have a chance to play it. So that's the reason we have that loss. It's just a pickup court that I made. Like, nothing serious. No new team or anything like that. So... This game, I had a lockdown on me. You see right there, he jumped, I didn't get a green. It was a lightly contested, but I still made it somehow. And doing a backdoor to Dev, I just had to call it the play. But we started out losing this game, you see. The score is eight to 14, hitting a step back, getting the green. That was such a nice move. And this point guard on the other team was actually pretty decent. You see, they go up three. They got four right there because they were up one. He knew what he was doing, that point guard. He definitely did. Throwing the dot over there. Oh, my gosh. Dev is a good shooter with a lock, too. I know so. So then they hit that corner three. Pop helped a little bit. And I was like, oh, I should have picked up. Even though he wanted the center to switch, it's whatever. I come back, respond with another three, put us back up on. Okay. And this point guard comes down, gets a dunk, and then nobody's guarding me on the other end, so now we're up two.
So then, middle of the fourth quarter, we're down to break ankles, step by green. So. I gotta come in clutch so you know I get the crab, get the green. They're even jumping at me. And then right there, I get absolutely killed by the stretch break. I was not prepared for a dex, especially because he hasn't scored all game. But, you know, I can guard it. It's just I wasn't expecting it. So he tried doing it again, it wasn't working. See, I got my takeover though. Down one. The other point guard also has his takeover. We were going back and forth. You see the stretch trying to kill me like he just did. It's not happening. I was expecting it now. Because he just I'm did ready, it. But... His playmaker is dribbling too much. Yeah. Backdoor. Contested layup does not go in. Give me the ball, man. Give me the ball. Give me an ISO. I don't care he's a lockdown. Give me an ISO. Give me them angles. Oh my, what a nice move, bro. The Jamal Crawford layup is just too nice. The center missed the layup. He could have took that layup to okay. win. It was an open Let's layup, go. the best luck they had, but he passed out of it. That center had that. <laughs> See, I dropped 25 and 7. Not, I had a very bad first half shooting. But then I brought it back for the second half, and I came up clutch. Now, this next game, this one was very interesting because I had a little back-and-forth duel oh, yeah. with this sharpshooter on the other team. He was guarding me, I was guarding him, and we were just trading buckets every single possession. See, right there, he's stepping back from deep. He is a pure sharpshooter, and he was dribbling, getting off-ball screens, wrapping, everything, basically. He got his takeover. He's hitting lightly contested shots now. So I come back. I'm just working it. He couldn't really guard me, but it was hard to guard him too, especially when we had to do so many switches because they were rapping so much. Right there, we get a good contest on his fadeaway that like he was working in the corner. Come down on fast break, get an easy transition three. Nobody was stopping me. We're up three. And then, I had my takeover. I also don't. He blocked me, and then we ended up giving up on the transition three. So, kind of went back. So this time I was just like, I'm gonna ice on, I'm not gonna take it inside. I'm gonna get the three. I'm not gonna get blocked again. This is two's quarter, this is pro am. What the f is going on? <laughs> you see, they hit me with the cheese, man. The post cheese. I couldn't get to him. Nobody helped me. I can't believe I just saw that in pro am, too. This kid just coming off all types of screens, all types of pumps, getting open shots. They go up one. I don't know how I didn't get that steal right there. I t perfectly timed it. He fades away, gets a little bit of space. Great. Of course it goes in. Now he's got his badge again. So I got to come up big, you know. I just start icing on him. I go in. You gotta hit him with the fundy sometimes. You gotta be a 6'4", Tim Duncan sometimes. You just gotta do it. Still, a little bit too much help, but that guy was killing. We had to help on him. And three minutes left in the game, I'm just like, give me this kid on the ISO. He should have can't guard me. The screens aren't working. Just let me get one-on-one -on -one with him. And this point in the game, we just start trading buckets back and forth. We're down four, two minutes, 30 seconds left. Go inside, get a dunk. I just started to take over the game at the fourth quarter, but they were still scoring all around. They had a point forward on their team with two sharpshooters, so that guy helped in the corner. Hit Rich. Rich is not going to three point shooter from the corner. Down one. We ended up getting a stop. Getting another easy layup. The kid just could not guard me. Now I have takeover. 
they hit it to the point forward in the corner Hell after no. we held that. I can't believe a point forward hit that. So I got him on the five out, minute left. Terrible shot, oh my god. Terrible shot, but he comes back, takes another He's terrible right shot. So I messed up, but he also messed up too. But you think I'm not clutch? You think I'm not clutch enough though? You think I wouldn't be able to, yeah. Lightly contested, green light, leaning back, puts us up one. Super close game. Got it! <laughs> <laughs> no, he moved. Couldn't believe it. Jive inside. We were supposed to give the back door to Rich, but I had a wide open lead, <laughs> so I might as well take it. I did have it though. Oh yeah. my god. Uh, no. He forced a shot at the end. Doesn't even matter. We won by five. What a back and forth game. He had 27. I had 33. Super close game. Super entertaining. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you haven't already, make sure you drop a like on this video. The more likes, the more I know to upload Pro Am. And also make sure you follow me on all my social medias down in the description and subscribe. It's been Young Precise and I'm out. Peace. Hey, that I'm out here breaking hearts now. Every time I come around, they know it's going down. I was in the game, these other niggas out of bounds. Don't play victim like y'all care because I'm not a clown. When they ask me where I've been, my ass don't make a sound.